It's like the Titanic, like, we know what the tragedy is. I want to see a bunch of people die, though. Or, you know, fake people. Not that the people on the Titanic were fake, just, you know, these guys are fake. These aren't real people. They don't have lives. They were born for this purpose. To stand in a line, get charged at by some dudes with swords, and try to survive. And you know, even if they do survive, they don't, because they get wiped from existence as soon as the round ends. That is the existence of an NPC. A worthless, meaningless, painful existence for our entertainment. You sick fucks. Hello guys, I have a very simple concept of a video for you. We take a bunch of crossbows, a bunch of legionnaires, we make them fight. But, we give the crossbows trenches. We want to see how far we can push a crossbows. So, same idea as that cinematic, and we will try to keep pushing the number of legionaries up and up and up and up until we eventually hit 1,000 legionaries. Um, and we will do whatever it takes to hold 1,000 legionaries with these trenches. But before that, we need a baseline. So our baseline, uh, I think a flat desert should work, right? Our baseline is going to be starting with the sharpshooters still. And let's just see how a 500 versus 500 goes. So we have something to, to compare it against. Let's get this, let's get the legionaries. This music is way too fucking loud for me, I can't even hear myself. This is not quite the map I was thinking of, but I think it'll work. So let's try it. So this will be our baseline, 500 v 500. I expect... Honestly, it might be closer than I think. Because 500 crossbows is a fuck ton of crossbows to be shooting at you. But they're legionaries, they have shields, so... I expect the legionaries to win, honestly, pretty easily. We could, though. Can we get her? Not quite. I think the crossbows will do the job, and I might just die here. Okay. Let's get away. I've interfered enough. This is an experiment, definitely. It's super scientific, right? God, that's a lot of crossbows. Holy shit. Okay, we finally gotten our second kill. <laughs> and the legionaries are almost on us. This is gonna go great. Three kills. Oh, easy. We're definitely not gonna lose. Okay. Cool. My guys are routing. Bye, guys. Ow. Fuck off. Look, I think we know the result of that. How many did we kill, though? We killed 150. So we have our baseline. 500 or 450 deaths, 150 kills, so uh, one to three. And I think we will do much better. We need to beat three to one or one third KD. I think that's going to be pretty fucking easy with the trenches. So let's see how they do. Oh wow, we're already shooting. God damn, they got range. Holy shit, sharpshooter indeed. Okay, they are going at it. They are doing already ahead. Oh! Oh, get fucked. That's why I chose you. You don't have a shield. Okay, already doing better than the last game. We got the first two kills way faster. Still don't have the third. There we go. There's the third. Okay, we're doing about the same. I think, though, as soon as they engage, that's when we're really... Oh, no. Oh, actually. Holy shit, doing great. 
we actually are doing way better already. And now is when we do better. Because the AI, when they enter the trenches, that's when they're going to turn. There we go. Yep. See, it's just hitting their sides. A couple of them are turning. Most of them are just focused on the guys in front of them. And the guys up here are, let's be real, they're bait for these crossbows on the other three lines to just completely wreck these poor, 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 decrepit soldiers. God damn, we actually might win. I think... I think the legionaries are gonna break. I think we're gonna win before they even take out the second line. Yeah, they're already running. Who's, who else is running? Okay, they only have a few. Yeah, the second line wins the melee fight. Holy shit, that's overpowered. So, pro tip. Uh, if you're playing as Vlandia with sharpshooters only, uh, just find some trenches, I guess. Tell your dudes to forget the shield, take a shovel. Do we even need to continue? 450 to 150. We have completely reversed courses with an over greater than 3 to 1 KD and um, easy dubs. Can't believe I said that. Fuck. Ugh, that felt gross. Okay, 600. Nope, not, not 1,000. We'll go with. Nah, we can go with. We got 3 to 1 KD. Yeah, we can go 1,000. Easy. Oh, we can only have 333 because the limit is artificially set to 1,000. There is the battle size mod. It does not currently work. So I cannot increase that to 2,000 uh, foot units. All right. That is, I think, so if we have 333, they have 666, and then me as well. They're evil. They have, they have the mean, they have the bad number, remember? That, <laughs> that means they're the bad guys, because of a number. Here we go. Come on. Next volley. Lovely shots. I don't know if we actually win this. It's 500 v 500. Like, we had an extra, what, 167 crossbowmen last time. So now we're outnumbered on the field 2 to 1. Oh shit, I fucked up. I did 500 units, so when they enough of these guys die and my crossbows spawn in, they're gonna spawn in like over here in front. So they're gonna spawn behind the behind the legionaries. Uh-oh. Yeah, this uh I think we win this. The legionaries are like, yes, we went through the trenches, we made it. And then uh a bunch of dudes just come up behind them, shoot them in the back. God, that's a slaughter right there. That's not even fair. Oof. What a powerful crossbow bow. Who shot that? You're amazing. 500 pound bow. Easy. <laughs> Look at this guy. Look at these two guys run. Just bringing half a dozen of them, chasing them, getting shot in the back as a result. Okay, I don't think Second Lion uh, makes it this time. I do think third line does, though. We got a lot more in the third line. Oh yeah, look at that kill feed. Okay, we got this. Yeah, we got this. How are we doing? We lost... Huh? It's actually... Fa it's favoring us, I think. No. We're actually still a little bit behind. Oh, now, now we're ahead. Oh no! <laughs> This isn't fair! Oh, what are they doing? Maybe it is fair. Oh my god. Oh, they're getting shot from both sides now. No! God, that's not okay. Okay. 
So we need to limit the total number of troops to 1,000 to prevent um, this mess. These guys are coming though, they'll save the day. Oh, damn. Oh, you know what? I think we lose because these guys are about to run out of ammo. And then these guys with the fresh ammo, uh, well, obviously they're not gonna use it. Yeah, I think we lose. Okay, let's just see how it plays out though. Maybe, maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe I uh, interfere a bit and say, yeah, most of you are out of ammo anyway. Say, go ahead and charge them. See what you can do. Oh, this poor man. What are you doing? What are you doing? Running in alone like that. Oh boy. Oh no. Yeah. That was going well until... Until a guy spawned and they just turned around and killed them all. Okay. So, we will try... We did, what, 50-50, 1 to 1. We will try a 2 to 1 ratio again, but make sure the total troops is 1,000. So it'll only be 666 versus 333. That'll be the most fair way of doing that. Let's go. 333, and actually 33. Four, haha, -ha, because I get to be in there. And you know, it's a thousand, not 999. Come on. 666, start. Ready, set, go. And the legionaries are marching, marching, marching. They got the shields up already. They are being fired across from a fired at from across the map and they honestly not looking too intimidating I know it's the same exact amount but I think we still win this screw them right we can win a 2v1 easy all right um I might have the back line hold their fire go ahead and do that you guys hold your fire until they break through this line. When they start fire fighting here, you guys can start shooting, and that way you don't miss, you know, all of your fucking shots. There we go. This is the best opportunity. Get those kills. Get those kills. Come on. I believe in you guys. Oh, you're not doing great. Not doing as well as I wanted. It's about even. That's not bad. I mean, that is very bad. Oh, more. Oh, no, more. They're already coming. Okay, that was... That happened a little faster than I thought it would. But you guys, go ahead and start shooting. Maybe that was a mistake. Ooh, that's a beautiful shot. No, they're missing most of them. I don't think that was a mistake. And why are they shooting over there? Shoot here. Shoot the ge the closer guys. The guys killing our guys. There we go. Look at that feed. Nope. Still up. Uh, yeah. Lots of green. I think we might be catching up. Oh. We're not hitting 2 1. We're just under 2 to 1 KD. We're catching up though. I don't know. We're running out of troops, so we can't, it's harder to maintain the KD when we have fewer arrows shooting at the enemy. We can't maintain our, like, a rate of fire. How are they doing? They're going for it. Why are any of you firing across here? What What are you doing? What, you, these are the only guys left with the ammo, and they're not firing at the guys right in front of them that they won't miss. They're like, nah, 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 I'm a sharpshooter. I will sharpshoot across the map and miss every single shot, because I'm useless. Let's go, come on. 
Nah, I don't think we got this. Unless they pull out some serious kills. No, we're done. They're surrendering. This is a war crime. Oh no. Okay, 441 to 332. So we still killed more, just not as many as we wanted. So that's what? A 4 to 3. I'm just gonna drop it. I'm gonna bump us up to like 350. You know, maybe maybe 400. And bump them down to 600. I think we win that. I think that's a close fight. And after that, our best chance is to see how other units do. Because, you know, once we switch to Fion, it's easy. We all know what the Fion result is gonna be. We Still want to see it though, right? It's like the Titanic, like, we know what the tragedy is. I want to see a bunch of people die though. Or, you know, fake people. Not that the people on the Titanic were fake, just, you know, these guys are fake. These aren't real people. They don't have lives. They were born for this purpose to stand in a line, get charged at by some dudes with swords and try to survive. And you know, even if they do survive, they don't, because they get wiped from existence as soon as the round ends. That is the existence of an NPC. A worthless, meaningless, painful existence for our entertainment. You sick fucks. Still watching, huh? Here we go. First line, firing. Boom. Bunch of hits. No kills, because they have this thing called a shield. You'd think, you know, the guys would aim just a little higher, knock a helmet off, but nope. Uh, the shields have... not bullet magnetism, I guess. They have, um... Look at this guy. These guys protecting their face. Smart. These guys up front, a lot of them aren't protecting their face. They're holding their shield low. Shots still aren't hitting their face, though. They have crossbow magnetism. It's a superpower. We lost it over time. We got replaced by bullet magnetism, but only for a select few. Alright, here comes... here come the kills. Oh, that's not a good kill feed. That's not the one we want to see. We want to see green. More green. More green. More green. That's what we want to see. Yes, just like that. Okay. The guys are going at full volley. Murdering. And we are actually winning this fight. And just in terms of percentage lost. That is great. I think... I think we might have this. I think, yep, unless if these guys, you know, run out of ammo because I forgot to tell them to hold fire. But you know what, they ran out of ammo last time anyways after I told them to hold fire. So maybe that was the wrong call, maybe they could have won. I don't think so, it wasn't even close. Oh boy. These guys are all, oh look at the green. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, look at this guy, this coward. He's running. He's running. He's trying to block his allies. Oh, they can't get out. He can't get out. Oh, he's just being pushed. Oh. They are not going to make it past the second tier. Incredibly easy. I guess that's what happens when you change the... You know, change it by a total of a hundred. But that's great. Okay. So, we're gonna end up probably even better than 5 to 2. Okay, 3 to 1. As long as we have the numbers, we do great. So, 5 to 2. A little better than 5 to 2, actually. Let's not count these because they already ran. Wait, are there guys? Yeah. Look at these chads. All. 
big mustachioed twins, triplets, quadruplets. They're all brothers. Or, you know, they're from the same town. They just got hired. It was very isolated back then, a lot of inbreeding, unfortunately. But, you know, it is what it is. Okay. We can push this. But we're close, we know that. So let's try... I'm gonna swing back the other way. Let's try... 350. I don't think we, we... No, we tried that. We can't do 650. I mean, 350 is closer to 333. Maybe we do... 380. Nah. 370. What is the max? What is... 370, that leaves us with, uh, 630. We win that. That's barely any less. Why would we lose that? Easy. Go ahead and cut now to the loss. Three. No, five. Three. Two. One guy. You can do it. Nope, no you can't. I didn't think you would. No offense. I was just telling you you could to make you feel better. Okay, next line. How are these guys? They're still shooting. They're not out of ammo yet. I think they run out of ammo while these guys continue to fight. I see a lot of these guys here on this line are already out. That means these guys can't be far behind in terms of ammo. If I see these guys run out of ammo, I'm just charging them. There's no sense in not. But for now, these guys hold. They delay. The arrows do the work. How are the legionaries doing? You know, the legionaries might break. Oh. Few and fewer shooting. This might be it soon. I think we run out of ammo. We charge. Legionaries break. We win. And then we try again. We push it a little harder. Watch us push it back up to 650 and get really confused on why they're suddenly winning. Okay, that's about it. Charge. Yeah, they got eight, eight guys. That's that's nothing. Oh, yeah, as soon as they charge, they're gone. That's hilarious. Okay, how's our KD? Little over two to one. That's great. Okay, we're gonna try 650 again. Did, did we even try 650, or is this just like a false memory? You know what? I'm thinking of the the Entrenched Hill, the, the Bannerlord cinematic. I tried 650 on that map. That's what I'm thinking of. Could not do it. Same exact setup, same exact heroes and enemy commanders and everything. So the only difference between that map and this one is, you know, the actual map, the types of fortifications given to our brave soldiers. Let's try it out. Excellent. Yeah, they're pretty accurate. No, come on, that was completely white. Who shot these three? Change your names. Go down a rank. Learn how to use your crossbow again. All you have to do is hit the giant pink blob, okay? No excuse to be missing that. Yeah, they're really far. It's also a bigger target. Here we go. It is favoring us? Yes, maybe. Ooh, never mind, no. God, these guys are already here. Uh-oh. I, uh... Hmm. This is not going... You know what, that guy's lasting a long time. This guy's... We might have forced them to trickle in slow enough that... Or trick them into trickling in slowly enough that uh, legionaries lose this one. Oh, a couple of these guys got forced up. Uh, I did provide a way for them to get back down. They just kind of drop like that. And how are we doing? Oh, look at that green. We are wrecking them. I think we are winning now. Yes, we are. But the legionaries are already heading towards the third line but you know what they're getting kills 
Let's look at the bodies. What happened to the bodies? Too many bodies, I guess. Goddamn. Yeah, we definitely got out ahead on that exchange. I would like to point out there's a good chance our own guys are getting shot in the back as well. Just less than the enemy. Oh, we got this. Oh, easy. We just wait for these guys to run out of ammo. And then we're done. That's it. We charge them. These guys break. No way they don't. Come on, keep shooting. You're not out of ammo yet. Ah, uh, <laughs> they're kind of catching up. Come on. There we go. There's the kills. Come on, keep going. More. Oh, not a lot of you have shots left. Enough of you to keep this. Oh. Okay, I think we're done. I think we're charging. Go. How are you doing? You guys go there. I got a secret shortcut that you guys can't take. How does this do? Do we win? Oh, it's gonna be close. Those guys are breaking, so these guys need to turn here and engage and not chase the guys who are running. Good job. Push, push, push. How is the other side doing? We, I think we lose the other side, but I think we win this side. Come on. Break those legionaries. Get them. Get them. Get them. Oh, they're already broken and you're just wasting the swings. No, don't chase them. Oh my god, did we win over there? They broke. They actually broke. Look at that, they're pushing through the crossbows. But they're just trying to run away by pushing the crossbows out of the way. They're not trying to actually fight. Oh, they would have had that fight had they not broken. That was very close. That fight could have gone either way. My guys could have broken too. Over here. I don't think spreading them out will help. Because the issue with spreading them out is that when the legionaries meet them, uh, they don't actually last longer if I spread them out. What'll happen is they'll just kind of trickle in the fight, and there won't be like a mass of them to block the legionaries, and they'll die a lot faster as, as a result. <laughs> Whereas if we keep them clumped up a little more, what happens is instead of, you know, four guys engaging, we have maybe, what, 12 guys engaging in melee? And that blocks them up, gives our archers behind more time to shoot. It's about mass. Come on. We'll still test it after this, if we lose. But... Nah, we got this, we don't lose. We'll never lose. Oh. That's not not the best, but we're, we're, we're used to this, we're expecting this. The green comes after this. Come on. Last longer. Yeah, get stuck and glitchy. It'll last longer that way. If you, if you bounce around like some sort of teleporting demon, then they can't hit you. Keep getting your shots in, you guys keep shooting. Are you guys not... Hello? Hello, shoot. No, don't shoot him! Don't shoot these two! Shoot these guys! What are you gonna do? I swear, this is the most useless group. They're not the ones... Like, not only is their aim bad, but they ju their targets are bad. Just like, get the guys close by. Get the guys you can hit. Yeah, that's where you want them. Hold them there. No, shield wall. Shield wall. Which is... Little help. There you go. That doesn't count. You guys didn't see that. Little help. There you go. Oh, those guys got pushed back. And that is a pretty, pretty convincing loss. They still have 205. Ah, you can't fucking get to. Ow, oh, fuck. Stay away. Hey, it's Future Sheep here, and this video went way longer than I expected it to, so I'm gonna cut it into at least two, if not three parts. 
The first is obviously what you just saw, how far can we go with only sharpshooters. However, in our quest to defeat the greatest number of legionaries, we are going to start adding a bit of infantry to slow them down, and perhaps even some Feons, we'll see. As for the map itself, as you can see it's in an incomplete state, with terrain elevation being super basic and flat, not all the nav mesh being done, the complete portions being the field in front of the trench and the trenches themselves, and finally a lack of flora other than trees, which I can't do anything about as that's a 1.7.2 issue. Flora layers just aren't working. Tail Worlds is aware of the bug though and is currently looking for a solution. That's all I have to say for now, so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this and I hope to see you on the next one.